we're joined by stylist Trudy Bennett to find out what colours we should actually be wearing to best complement our skin colour. Welcome back, Trudy. Thank you. And I've brought into the studio my lovely model, oh, Mike. Oh, what a lovely model. He'll be helping us out today, but don't say anything, Mike. No, no, no talking. Shh. No talking. You're a baby today. Okay, so what's the science behind your colours? So the basic science, Mel, is you have a warm or cool undertone to your skin. Okay. So it's about finding out what that is. So for instance, our lovely model here has a cool undertone. Cool. Cool. Oh, shush. Right, shush. Right, yeah, shush. shush. And yeah. you have a warm undertone. And I'm going to try and show the viewers at home okay. what that actually looked like. Now, they need to be reminded that you both have makeup. Or oh, maybe not this model. Oh, I, I have a little bit. He's yeah. got a ton of makeup on, <laughs> thank you very much. More than me. <laughs> okay, so what are we going to so do? So gold represents warm mm -hmm. and silver represents cool. So right. we'll do Mel first. Okay. So we're, we're, yeah, okay. Okay, so that's warm. And hopefully the viewers will be able to see. And that's cool. Now, when we put that on, okay, sort of washes her out a bit. Okay, not as great. That's right, do the before, do the before face. Lovely. And hopefully <laughs> what we're going to be able to see is lovely. Look at that. <laughs> Gorgeous. Oh, yeah, I see the difference. Yeah, that's good. Good? That's okay, good. it's your turn, Mike. Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay. So I'm cool. You're cool. <laughs> <laughs> Who knew? So, so this is where you shouldn't really be going down the road of, of before gold. Before face. Good. See. see, that's the before face. See, he looks a bit sallowy, skin's all sort of uneven, oh. not as perky as normal. But wait, there's more. But wait. Once we do this lovely silver. Oh, he's just positively glowing. So it's it radiant. is actually. It is. I see. So what, so what are the benefits then of getting your colours done, Trudy? So there's many benefits, uh, and they are that... Um, when you have great colour up near your face, it evens out your skin tone, you look healthy, fine lines and wrinkles disappear, your teeth look white, you just look really, really well. Okay, so, okay, so we all want to do the best with what we have. Obviously it's not just silver and gold, there are other no, things in these the colours. Whole, so, so warm and cool, there's an equivalent in both palettes. Right. So for instance, there's a warm pink and a cool pink and a warm blue and a cool blue. And so if you're of that tone, if you stick with yours, it has heaps of benefits. And if you wear the wrong colours, what is likely to happen? What's likely to happen is you can start looking a bit tired and, I hate saying it, a bit older. <laughs> a bit older. A bit, a bit older. older and a bit tired. Well, that explains an awful lot, doesn't it? <laughs> OK, so I know I'm not supposed to ask any questions, but I'm curious, how do we find out what colour suits us best? Well, you can do two things. Either you hire someone, colour consultant like myself, to, um, to help you with that, or you can actually think about all the colours that people have complimented you on. OK, cool. Okay, so but they, they say have you to, look great. Yeah, well, yeah. You, have, you have to have been mentioned in it. So, for instance, if they say you look great or you look really well or your eye colour looks really yeah. fantastic, then you know that's actually a great colour for you. When I wear navy and when I wear a pink, people always say I look good. OK, that's good. You and look good it, in that. it depends on whether... Well, speaking of pink, if we have time, I'll just do a quick warm and cool. Really quickly? Yep, okay. really quickly. What okay. about black? Who should wear black? Black? Mike can wear black. Yeah? Can I wear black? Mike can black. wear black. I can't wear black. Can I wear black? <laughs> I love black. Can I wear black? Is that you before? That looks like dog food. It's so <laughs> impressive. So, yeah, and it's going to actually make his face look okay. a bit like dog food. So, so let's have a look at that. That's, that's ugly. Definitely so that's, a that's a warm pink, okay? So it's all sort of muddy. That'll but suit what, me, though. What? Yes, it would. Yuck. And what? <laughs> yay. And what suits you with these clear, bright colours, Mike? So as you can see, that's really fantastic. No, actually, I can see. I can see the difference. You can see yeah. the difference? Hey, that actually does really suit you. Okay, well, thank you very much. You were meant to be quiet, Mike. I know. I can't help myself, yeah, sorry. You, you that was really actually really interesting, Trudy. Thank you so much You're for that. You're very welcome. Maybe I need to get some colours done.